It's a time for crafting. It's a time for crafting. It's a time for crafting now. <coughs> Hello, ladies and gentlemen. What we have today? Today we have a D and D DV screen. Why now? There are two reasons why now. First reason, it's not easy to buy a new TV and make sticks like that when you make it for the first time. I found a nice uh, old TV screen. I had some easy to use tools, nothing fancy, not a $20 build with $100 tools. The second thing that made me to do now the TV screen is the RPG stories. It's a 3D world builder that you have to look it's on kickstarter right now if you like it buy it you can use it on your pc with other players like roll 20 i hope i will use it for me in my house uh, with my friends and on that tv screen with my 3d worlds to play keep them in your eyes and let's go and see what we're gonna make today first of all i'm gonna unscrew the back of my tv I want to use the holes from that bag to secure my TV on my uh, wooden case. On the back, we're gonna see two speakers that I'm gonna use and I'm gonna put to my TV later on. I'm gonna measure what I need. The length of the sides is gonna be the length of your TV and the, the thickness of your wood from the one side and from the other side so they can lock together when we screw them together. I'm gonna cut it with a jink saw, if I name it correctly, but you can cut it with your hand saw or a table saw or whatever you like. On the one side of my TV case I'm gonna put the buttons and a small hole for the cables and all this electronic stuff. You can always glue them in place, but I found out that it was easy to make a nice 3D printed uh, part and glue the buttons on it and it looks more more professional, more sexy, more romantic, more, more, it looks more. So I'm gonna cut two small holes for them and for my controller I'm gonna use one hole of the wooden planks and just make some room and glue it in place so I can have the control when I want to change uh, things on my TV without the buttons. And this is the back of my TV. Now, it's the time to put all the pieces together, just pre-drill some holes. If you want, you can use some wood glue for the joints and two screws and it's ready to go. It's a small TV. I'm not afraid that we're gonna break or something. And I'm gonna use two small woods just to make the case stronger and mount my TV on the case. This is the most tricky part. So I'm gonna use the screws from TV, from the back of TV and the two holes from the back of my TV and I'm gonna use some corners, metallic corners and I'm gonna screw the corners on my TV then the corners on the wood and this is it. That's the case. You see it's very easy. I'm just drill some holes and then screw the screws screw the screws okay and that's it easy the most tricky part here is that exactly how to mount the TV on the case you can always use some plexiglass for the top just to secure everything in place it's easier for me to do it like that easy as always and fast for me today's build if I remember correctly and now for the last thing I'm gonna use the speakers I just again 3D printed uh, some small fits so the speaker can sit on it because there are some rubbers that they absorb the vibrations of the speaker so we have a better quality sound again this is not a good speaker at all but it's free so it's a good speaker at all so I put them on the screen, I put them on the case, one on the top and one on the bottom of my case and screw them in place and that's all. And this is how it looks. It's very nice, I use some maps that I made in Dungeon Draft and it looks so, so 
good. It looks so good with the materials we had and with the time we spent on it. And that's it. Easy, fast, today's build and wonderful. Go around, ask someone if they have an old TV that doesn't want. And if you build it, just send it to my Instagram to see some new ideas, everything. Uh, thank you so much. Uh, I hope you are gonna see you soon, not in one year from now. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, subscribe if you didn't subscribe. And see you at the next episode. See you, trailer. Bye.